Hi, this is Alex Palt, and I'm here at the APEC Show 2018 in uh, San Antonio, Texas. And I'm here with uh, Eric DeBros. He's with uh, AVX. And I see you have this very interesting uh, machinery here. What does it do? Yes, we have our uh, new, uh, thanks to Ron Demko, he helped out make this AVX super capacitor demo box. And basically, we're able to use a one-part SCM series. It's uh, rated for 5 volts, 2.5 farads. And it'll quickly charge up and show instantaneous charge and discharge of you know, super cap and its advantages to run this quick DC brushless motor. Mm-hmm. Well, then let's walk through the demo. Sure. So basically, we're going to switch this on, charge charge the cap up real quick, and you're going to see here, here, voltage meter and current going through it. Charge it up to just past the 5 volts. Switch that off, and, you know, we'll take this out to show that, you know, nothing cheating off the battery here. Nothing up my sleeve? Nothing, no, no, no cheating. <laughs> we're going to discharge now. You can see here that we can... Speed up the RPMs. Run the fan there. Very neat, quick, and you know we could do this over and over and over again. That's one of the main advantages to supercaps. Very nice. So now, um, what is the, what is the big implication for me, the design engineer, in this? Um, a lot of it's going to come down to expectations of what your operating temperatures, your operating conditions, uh, super caps. What we're able to do is between minus 40 and plus 85. Uh, size constraints are a big issue. Uh, expectation of cost. Very nice. So um, where can they go to get more information? AVX has got a URL, I'm guessing, avx.com. I'm right Absolutely, avx.com slash supercapacitors. Uh, one of the main worries is, you know, your expectation of what your application is. You know, we're able to do uh, energy harvesting, pulse power, power holdup, battery replacement, even in combination with a battery. Well, I, I gather with a battery would help with the uh, lifetime of the battery, performance of the battery? Oh, yeah. It takes, up, uh, the, takes those main hits of current. So it extends the lifetime almost exponentially. Really? Almost exponentially? So um, it, then why aren't we using more of these in? Because it's just simply cost issue. A lot of it is expectation of cost. Got it, got it. Fit and size, cost, main things. And so um, what, what are the, uh, what product model was that again, that uh, capacitor, super capacitor you're using in this demo? Uh, sorry, again? The, 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 what was the model number of the device you're currently using in this demo? This would be a 5 volt, 2.5 farad. And we got some other behind here. We could pop them in, different, different voltage ratings, different cap sizes, but as long as we got, uh, this is rated for 5 volts. So. so that's why you're using the smaller device for this demo? Correct, yes. Got you. Well, hey, thank you so much, Eric, for talking to us in this really busy show. Appreciate your time, Alex.